Hey guys, so review on micro hot air gun. I got it like this. I didn't open it, so I will open it with you. So what we will have here is. the hot air gun heating element for the hot air gun power cord couple of uh, nozzles small and a big one stand for the hot air gun this is the small one the big one okay We have here the module itself. You can change the temperature, you can change the airflow, you can do a lot of things. This hot air gun is very, very cheap. So I was surprised that hot air gun can be this cheap. So we will test it together today. So, the power cord, the hot air gun itself, you connect it right here. the nozzles okay. the stand itself I think it's supposed to be like this yeah or like this I'm not sure about that or like this we will see about that or like this like if you have it like this yeah it's supposed to be like this so let's uh, see if the price worth like uh, this was super cheap and i want to see if it uh, paid off is it rubbish or uh, is it good Okay. Okay, probably there is a magnet on the stand or something. When it's out of the, uh, the stand, it will turn on. When it's in the stand, it will turn off let's see how much it will go up four hundred and eighty this will show you that it will it's getting there and this is is hot now how do we 
control the airflow if f1 oh 5 is the minimum 10 is the maximum okay so basically the off on button is the mode the mode switch and the setup okay it didn't turn off why is that Okay, it's getting down. I think after it will get. Let's see. What is this? Like No. Wheel. Before it went off when I put it on the stand. Now it's just getting down on the temperature. That is wheel. Oh. I think it has to go off the of the tempo cell so it can can turn the off. Let's put it on maximum airflow, maximum tempo cell. I want to see if it will uh, turn off by itself. yeah so basically when you put it on the stand it, it will turn off but uh, when the temperature gets to the 100 uh, it takes seconds or two but uh, it look at that it takes seconds to get to full temperature so that is good and when you put it back it also takes a couple of seconds to get to the, to 100 uh, degrees and uh, after uh, it gets down it will turn off by itself so that is good now i wanna check if it's uh, worth the money because this is thing is so cheap okay so i have here uh, a board of a scooter controller so uh, let's see, I wanna get uh, this chip and maybe some chips. Let's see if we can get stuff off first. Yeah, let's see if I can get this chip off. Okay, I want to set it to 400.
and let's use when you wanna get something off you should use the biggest nozzle that it fits the part that you are taking off 